HTTP basic authentication with Python in less than 60 seconds. Is it possible? Yes, it is. Welcome to the channel. I'm Martin. Let's go. So we are starting off with starting the timer and it counts a second. So now I have to be fast. I have to say import request. So the request module is normally not installed by default in Python. So you have to do a pip install request. So basically pip install request is your best friend in this case. And we continue. So from the request module, from the request module in the auth, we can import HTTP based auth indications. And with this, we already have everything important. We can move on to our request. We'll go request get. Uh, HTTPS double colon slash slash some URL because we always query some URL. We can now do HTTP basic auth or we have to say auth. HTTP basic auth we say username equals username and password equals password. And with this we can now make our authenticated request. Cool thing is you are now unleashed let me quickly stop the timer because we are running out of time. You are now unleashed. Um, you can now not only query query uh, public APIs, but also <laughs> private APIs if they have basic authentication. Let me add a bit of a more explanation to this. Um, what I would like to do because normally now you would, every time you call this API or every time you call make a request, you would do the authentication, or you have to write the authentication. What I always recommend, and this is the bonus tip, you don't have to listen anymore, this is the bonus tip for all of you who are here for the golden nuggets. So if I now do a request, I would normally write like request HTTP basic auth and then do this, but instead we do uh, we do the following, we open a session. In this case we could say request session dot session and this is now a session object and with the session object I can define authentication in this case I would just do basic authentication I would say in this case I would still go username equals username and password equals password and the cool thing is now I can do a normal get to any of the URLs in this case it's some URL because it's always some URL and our request is already authenticated without us writing this every time. So I can do as many as I like and they will be all authenticated. So that's actually quite cool. You can also add headers. You can do many, many things more. I hope you like this. Um, there will be more following. I hope you like this. Please leave a like, subscribe to the channel. Um, see you next time.